Hello everyone, my name is Wendy Zellers and I'm a volunteer at the Mathai Botanical Gardens in Naples Arboretum and we're on the campus of the University of Michigan. So thank you for joining me today. I've been asked to share with you a few stories about my favorite tree. So would you like to come with me back in time? It's an adventure. So just follow me. I have five reasons why the ginkgo is my favorite tree. First, when I was a little bit older than you are, I took a class that included a section all about trees. And I learned so much about the ginkgo. It is such a weird and amazing tree. Then I started to do research on my own. And I found out just how wonderful and cool and strange this tree is. My second reason that the ginkgo is my favorite tree is because it is so old, we call it a living fossil. And here, I've got a picture here of a fossil, and you can just see the leaf right there. And remember, a fossil is simply the imprint of an object that has been preserved in stone or rock. And around this fossil, I have three leaves that I picked up here off the ground. And look of the ginkgo, and look how similar they are. That's why it's called a living fossil, because the leaves today are so similar to the leaves in this fossil. This particular fossil is 200 million years old. And 200 million years is a very long time ago. It's before there were flowers. It's before there were birds in the sky. It's before Tyrannosaurus Rex. Can you imagine that? The third reason the ginkgo is my favorite tree is because it is a survivor. And by that I mean it can grow in conditions that are cold and in conditions that are hot. It can grow in soil that is dry, like a desert. It can grow in wet soil, like on a river bank or stream bank. It will grow in full sun and it'll grow in shade. In fact, the ginkgo grows just about everywhere. The fourth reason the ginkgo is my favorite tree is because bugs don't eat it. It has built-in defenses against insects. So when an insect lands on one of its leaves and starts munching away, the ginkgo can send out a chemical that makes that leaf taste awful. At the same time, the ginkgo sends out another chemical that will attract the enemies of that pest. I just think that's brilliant. Anyway, the bugs will jump off or crawl away and look someplace else for them. So the fifth reason the ginkgo is my favorite tree is because the leaves are just so beautiful. I love this fan shape. It's so graceful in the wind. And in the fall, the leaves turn a brilliant golden yellow. And sometimes they'll just sort of fall all at once and they leave this carpet of gold around the bottom. So, I hope we get to see you here at Mathai Botanical Gardens. You can come and visit the ginkgos and all the other trees around and the wildlife that inhabit this wonderful place. So, Goodbye, everyone.